Here's a video file named Delay Email Delivery. And I have saved it to the Emerson Court folder on the G drive. And that's a folder that's very accessible. I think everybody who works at Emerson Court has access to the Emerson Court folder on the shared G drive. And if I wanted to get this to 50 or 60 people at Emerson Court, I could email it as an attachment, but that would be 50 or 60 attachments on 50 or 60 emails, and that would put a fair amount of pressure on the network. So here's a better way to do it. So I've got this file saved to the Emerson Court folder on the G drive. I'm going to launch Outlook. I would click New Email. I would put in the names of the people I want to send this to. The subject will say is Delay Delivery. And I could insert the file as an attachment to all of these emails, but instead I'm just going to write some text that says click here to see the video. And I'll select that text, right click on it, left click on hyperlink, up here I'm going to navigate to the G drive, find the folder named Emerson Court, find the video named Delay Delivery. It's going to be down at the bottom since it's not in a folder. So there's Delay Email Delivery MP4. So that address pops up down here. For the target frame, I like to change it to New Window. And then I click OK. Now I'm going to save this message. So I click on the little floppy disk, close the message. If I look in my drafts, here's this delayed delivery email that I'm ready to send where it says click to see the video. If you click there, there are times when you may it will take you to the video. So the 50 or 60 people I want to see, see this don't have to get an attachment in their email. They can just link directly to the file on the shared drive.